Hey YouTube, it's your girl Dr. J and I thought I would come and show you guys some of the stuff that I have for Faster Fox. For her um, fine motor skills um, electives and again this is because uh, all three of my kids are dysgraphic and since my twins are getting older and they're now um, officially in third grade I needed to make sure that they were still working on their fine motor skills due to their dysgraphia, but also doing something that was interesting for them and fun. So what I have for her, some of the stuff is uh, how to make balloon animals. And I just wanted to show people the kind of um, balloons that we use with this. So these are the kind of balloons that we use. And, and we do use a pump for the balloons because trying to blow these up is, is pretty much impossible. But it this is one, how to make balloon animals and then this is another one that we got and this one actually came in a kit with some balloons and a pump and stuff so those and she's done some but I'm challenging her to do a, a few more I got a book of yo-yo uh, for beginners and it has two yo-yos inside and it has a book with 25 tricks you can learn so I thought maybe that one would be fun she is learning how to sew she took a couple sewing classes at Joann Fabrics and I'll probably have her take a few more classes there this summer but I do have some books for her this one is sewing school 21 sewing projects kids will love to make this is sewing school too and it's lessons in the sewing machine and she does have her own sewing machine she has a so cool machine and she also has a real full-size sewing machine we did not do the go to another toy machine or a junior machine. Those did not have good reviews. And I was told to go ahead and get her started on a real machine. And when she took classes at Joanne Fabrics, she actually used our real machine. And so she's been trained in how to use the machine. So we just use that for her. She does still use the So Cool. And my boys actually use it as well for small um, projects because it will sew other types of fabric. But she's now moved on to a real sewing machine. This is a Sew Everything workshop and Sew Fun Machine for Sewing Fun, Sewing Machine Fun for Kids. And then my first sewing machine book. So she has all those and she can pick projects out of that. This is something I got off of Kickstarter. And you make a, it's a paper Velociraptor. And we backed it and got three different colors. But it's basically like an origami based velociraptor that you put together. This is a fashion uh, doll clothing that you can make. And a lot of it you kind of make from old socks, which is kind of cool. But she does use a glue gun and stuff like that. So I thought this would be good. She, she's made one dress out of here so far. But I thought this would be nice for her to play around with. She doesn't like to play with dolls that much. But she will... You know do some doll clothes even though she won't like to actually play with the dolls themselves this uh paracord jewelry and um it has the paracord in the back and these are just different projects that they have and those will get her using her fingers well this is origami i um had this book and i have another um, origami book but some of the directions weren't as clear as I thought they needed to be for her because she's only seven and so I went and bought and then this is her bucket filled with um, origami paper and then I went and got her this book because it was um, 35 projects for children seven and older but the directions were really clear and that's really what we needed. So I went ahead and got that for her, for her to do some projects out of that. This is a juggling set where she can learn to juggle. And so it has ha actually has a little instruction book in the bottom of that. This is, uh, she does geek sheets. So I will actually do a whole nother video on this and showing you what th that she's going to do this specifically as a larger elective just like Salamander is doing a builder's elective. She is doing a geek chic elective and this is going to be 
the primary book that we're using. And then this is another book that we'll be using, Fashion Tech. And so these are the kits that she's going to be using with it. This is a lily pad development board. And this is a, another lily pad set. And it has, um, these have the Adreno, Arduino with it. So this is all the stuff that she needs for that. And then this one also has an Arduino board that's inside uh, connected with the lily pad and get this open. So it has all the stuff that she needs in that with the board and the Arduino set for that. And she's going to be doing, like I said, I'll do another video just on her geek chic stuff because she's going to be doing a separate elective with this. This is a book on squishy circuits. And then some more circuitry stuff. This is a sticker, uh, circuitry sticker starter kit. And we, I also have a squishy circuits kit coming as well. Um, this is another kind of origami, but it's fashion. Paper fashions origami. And so it goes with, you know, how to do all this sort of stuff. Has little hangers. And then... The little templates and stuff back here and then the paper is inside there and then this is just um, more paper and hangers these are little cards she likes to make people note cards and I got these because these cards are very little and smaller means she has to work on her fine motor skills even more so these are two little card sets I got and then these are some so cute um, little project. She's done several of these already and she really likes those. And I picked these up at Hobby Lobby. And then this is um, some nail stuff. Um, I had originally got her this hand for nail painting and it's really hard to use that so I ended up getting her just the nails that were sitting up and then I just um, attach them to a paper plate so we could transport them around the house for her to be able to sit down and use those and then this is just one of the little nail art kits that I got because that will work on her fine motor skills in a different way and then this is another little hand that she can use so those are some of the things that I got for Faster Fox to work on her fine motor skills so she's going to be doing some of these and like I said I'll do a more extensive video just on the geek chic and um, fashion technology stuff that she's going to be doing so hope this helps this is Dr. J and I'm out bye bye